Season's greetings, Merry Christmas, and Happy Holidays, AC family. Welcome to another midweek episode of the Ants Canada Ant Channel. On this channel, I've had the opportunity to take some truly stunning, high-quality footage of ants and other creatures, and I quite frequently find myself getting lost in their micro-worlds, almost forgetting they are so small when seeing them so big on screen. It makes me wonder what would happen if ants were bigger, say human-sized. Well, from an ant nerd's perspective, I think I have a pretty good idea as to what theoretically might happen, as there could be a few outcomes, some of which may surprise you. Like can you imagine ants giving us body massages? I'll explain how this could happen and more in a bit. So before we get into that, be sure to hit the subscribe button and bell icon set on all to join the AC family. And hit like if you enjoyed this video. Now let's get to it. So check out this super macro footage of bullet ants, Diacama rugosum, from a recent video. Truly magnificent this close, right? Well, seeing them like this, it's easier to imagine us being their size, or them being our size. Try it for a moment. You're minding your own business and come across this tunnel with ants running by. What would you think would happen? The first and most obvious answer is, we'd all be doomed. If ants were human-sized, they'd be strong enough to lift things the size of entire houses and take down animals the size of a brontosaurus. They'd definitely be preying on our soft, tender bodies. And something tells me our military forces would have to really up our social protection against the ant beasts sharing the planet with us. Life would be quite different. We'd be hunted, advanced upon by organized raids, our houses and buildings broken into, and picked off one by one by swaths of these beasts who would sting us to death, spray us with formic acid to death, or just stretch us out by our limbs and take us back to the colony to be consumed alive by their young. Or, this might surprise you, they might not kill us, but instead form a symbiotic relationship with us, where our coexistence can benefit both ants and humans. Imagine we humans find a sustainable way to turn their garbage, feces, or leftover meals into edible human food. So having us around thereby helps keep their nests clean, much like springtails, isopods, and silverfish do. And in return, not only not kill us, but they allow us to live with them in their massive, mountain-sized, protected underground kingdoms. Or perhaps we become their hygienists. Imagine if we could pick off body mites from hard-to-reach places on the ants. In the same way predatory hypoaspis mites protect our golden empire, yellow crazy ant colony, from parasitic, blood-sucking mites. Now here's something crazy. Imagine ants found our feces or urine delicious. Highly unlikely due to the composition of our wastes, but imagine you're something like a mealybug for a sec, who excretes a byproduct ants just love called honeydew. And upon discovering us, the ants start to protect us 24-7, never leaving us alone, ensuring we breed and multiply okay, relocating us to better living environments if needed, and even giving us body massages, so we eliminate more often, all because they find our pee or poop delicious. Mealybugs live the high life, right? <laughs> yes, perhaps all of these are a stretch, but one thing's for sure, when you remove scale and have a look at these incredible creatures with a more intimate lens, you'll discover that ants are truly some of the most magnificent creatures on the planet, worthy of awe and respect. If you aren't convinced by now, then just watch a few more videos of this channel. The world of ants will truly blow your mind. Right, EC family? For those of you who like ant watching, I've left a hidden video for you here so you guys can just relax to some calm music and just watch ants. Trust me guys, it's the most relaxing thing ever. And I've got a whole playlist of videos like this for you. Thank you guys for watching. It's Ant Love forever. Hope you can subscribe to the channel as we upload every Saturday and possibly Wednesday now, if you keep enjoying these midweek videos at 8 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Please remember to like, 
comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video to help us keep making more. It's Ant Love forever.